friends now we have to form the quadratic equation from given roots friends don't forget to subscribe our channel because here we are trying to cover each and every problem of mathematics from class 1st to class 12 with english explanation as well as hindi explanation so friends subscribe our channel and now see the next video now first pair of roots is given here 0 and 4 and by using these roots we have to form the quadratic equation now to form quadratic equation by using given roots first we have to find sum of the roots and product of the roots so in this case alpha plus beta is equal to we have to find alpha plus beta is equal to value of alpha is 0 and value of beta is 4 so 0 plus 4 which is equal to 4 that means sum of these two roots alpha plus beta is equal to 4 and product of these two roots that means alpha into beta is equal to 0 into 4 means value of alpha 0 and value of beta 4 so 0 into 4 is equal to 0 that means product of these roots alpha into beta is equal to 0 therefore quadratic equation is x square minus in bracket alpha plus beta that means sum of the roots into variable x plus at the place of constant term product of the roots alpha into beta is equal to 0 this is the formula of quadratic equation means by this formula we can form quadratic equation by using sum of the roots and product of the roots or we can say by using roots of the equation now we have alpha plus beta we have alpha into beta so now we have to put these values in this equation so we get x square minus value of sum of the roots that is 4 so 4 into x plus value of product of the roots that is 0 so plus 0 is equal to 0 therefore it is x square minus 4x is equal to 0 so this is the required quadratic equation now second pair of roots of the equation is given 3 and minus 10 c and minus 10 let alpha is equal to 3 and beta is equal to minus 10 where alpha and beta are symbols for roots of the equation so sum of the roots that is alpha plus beta is equal to value of alpha that is 3 plus value of beta that is minus 10 c plus minus 10 that means 3 minus 10 which is equal to Minus seven. This is sum of the roots alpha plus beta minus seven. And product of the roots that is alpha into beta is equal to three into minus ten. Value of alpha is three and value of beta is minus ten. So three into minus ten, which is equal to minus thirty. This is product of these two roots alpha into beta minus thirty. Therefore, quadratic equation is. now we have to write formula to form quadratic equation by using these roots that means by using sum of the roots and product of the roots the formula is x square minus in bracket alpha plus beta sum of the roots into x plus at the place of constant term product of these roots that is alpha into beta is equal to 0 now we have these values we know alpha plus beta here we know alpha into beta so putting these values in this equation we get x square minus in bracket value of alpha plus beta sum of the roots minus 7 into x plus product of these roots alpha into beta that is minus 30 is equal to 0 therefore the equation is x square minus minus plus 7x minus 30 is equal to 0 x square plus 7x minus 30 is equal to 0 this is the required quadratic equation now third pair of given roots is 
वन अपॉइंट टू एंड माइनस वन अपॉइंट टू लेट अल्फा एंड बीटा बी द सिंबल्स फॉर दिस रूट्स ऑफ द इक्वेशन सो अल्फा इज इक्वल टू हाफ वन अपॉइंट टू एंड बीटा इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन अपॉइंट टू सो फर्स्ट वे टू फाइंड सम ऑफ द रूट अल्फा प्लस बीटा इज इक्वल टू हाफ वन अपॉइंट टू वैल्यू ऑफ अल्फा प्लस माइनस हाफ वैल्यू ऑफ बीटा विच इज इक्वल टू जीरो दैट मीन्स सम ऑफ द रूट अल्फा प्लस बीटा इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दिस रूट अल्फा इन टू बीटा इज इक्वल टू हाफ इन टू माइनस हाफ हाफ इन टू माइनस हाफ सो इट इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन अपॉन फोर माइनस वन अपॉन फोर देर फॉर क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन इज एज वी नो फॉर्म्यूला टू फॉर्म क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन बाई यूजिंग रूट इट इज एक्स स्क्वेर माइनस इन ब्रैकेट अल्फा प्लस बीटा इंटू एक्स प्लस प्रोडक्ट अल्फा इंटू बीटा इज इक्वल टू जीरो नाउ वी हैव सम ऑफ द रूट अल्फा प्लस बीटा वी ऑल्सो नो प्रोडक्ट ऑफ द रूट अल्फा इंटू बीटा सो पुटिंग दिस वैल्यू इन दिस इक्वेशन वी गेट एक्स स्क्वेर माइनस सम ऑफ द रूट दैट इज जीरो इंटू एक्स प्लस प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दिस रूट दैट इज माइनस वन अपॉन फोर इज इक्वल टू जीरो नाउ हियर लास्ट टर्म इट्स कॉन्स्टेंट टर्म हैज डिनोमीटर फोर सो मल्टीप्लाइंग बोथ द साइज बाय फोर वी गेट फोर एक्स स्क्वेर माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो बिकॉज कोफिशियंट ऑफ एक्स इज जीरो सो वी कैन रिमूव द टर्म सो द इक्वेशन इज फोर एक्स स्क्वेर माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो दिस इज द रिक्वायर्ड क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन Now in fourth case, the pair of these two roots is given: two minus root pi and two plus root pi. By using these two roots, we have to form quadratic equation. Let alpha and beta be the symbols for these two roots. So let alpha is equal to two minus root pi, and beta is equal to two plus root pi. Therefore, sum of the roots that is alpha plus beta is equal to Value of alpha that is two minus root five plus value of beta that is two plus root five. Now here minus root five plus root five cancel each other and we get two plus two, which is equal to four. And product of these two roots that is alpha into beta is equal to value of alpha two minus root five into value of beta two plus root five. So this product is equal to. Now here, in this product, we can apply formula x square minus y square. That means x minus y into x plus y is equal to x square minus y square. So by using this identity, here we get two square minus root pi square. That means four minus pi. So it is equal to minus one. This is product of these two roots, minus one. Therefore, quadratic equation is. as we know formula to form quadratic equation by using roots is x square minus in bracket sum of the roots alpha plus beta into x plus product of these roots alpha into beta is equal to 0 so substituting the values of sum of the roots alpha plus beta and product of the roots alpha into beta we get x square minus sum of the roots 4 x Plus alpha into beta, that is product of the roots minus one, is equal to zero. So x square minus four x minus one is equal to zero. This is the required quadratic equation.